Yves Rocher is a worldwide cosmetics and beauty brand, founded in 1959 by the French entrepreneur Yves Rocher in Le Gassilly. The company is present in 88 countries on five continents and employs 13,500 personnel, excluding more than 215,000 through additional indirect jobs. The Eve Rocha Group achieved a turnover of €2.012 billion Euros in 2004. The group also manages the brands Daniel Juvence, Dr. Pierre Rico, Isabelle Derwane, Petit Bateau, Coyotes, Stanholm and Galerie Noemi. The company maintains a botanical garden, the Jardin Botanique Yves Rocha de Le Gassilly, at its industrial site in Le Gassilly. It is open to the public without charge. Headquarters is located in Rennes, Brittany. Topic: <laughs> Foundation. The Eve Rocher Foundation was founded in 2016 by Eve Rocher under the aegis of the Institute of France since 2001. Topic: Controversy. Eve Rocher Vostok, the company's East European subsidiary, sued Russian opposition politician Alexei Navalny and his brother for fraud and money laundering. Novaya Gazeta accused Bruno Lepru, managing director of Eve Rocher Vostok, of assisting the Russian government's campaign against Alexei Navalny. Since August 2014, the One Question for Eve Rocher. Movement has been expanding in Europe in order to get the Yves Rocher Corporation to take a definitive position on the case against Navalny. On 30 December 2014, Alexei Navalny's brother Oleg was sentenced to three half a year forced labor and Alexei Navalny himself to a suspended sentence of three half a year. On 17 October 2017, ECHR decided that the case of fraud against Alexei and Oleg Navalny on the complaint of the company, Eve Rocha was considered in Russia with violation of the right to a fair trial. The court concluded that the verdict was arbitrary and unreasonable. According to the decision of the European Court of Human Rights, Russia must pay the brothers Navalny €76,000. The ECHR refused to consider the issue of political motivation. At the same time, three judges of the ECHR, Dmitry Dedov, Helen Keller and Georgios Sergides, expressed the opinion that it was necessary to consider a possible political background of the case. Despite the decision of the ECHR on 25 April 2018, the Presidium of the Supreme Court of Russia refused to revoke the verdict to the Navalny brothers in the case of Eve Rocha and decided to resume the case to consider new circumstances. <laughs> <laughs> 